Hey YouTube, this is Gohan from Dragon Ball Z. You're watching Amaturay Killer HD, the ultimate Super Saiyan. Hakai. Hey, what is up guys? It's me, I'm a tour killer, bringing you a video on Dragon Ball Idol. This is my second take because I messed up the first take because the camera was not here, but it was there or wherever the screen is. It was on top of the people's face. So in this video, we're going to be talking about the best possible SSS team you can make as a free to play user from all the units in the hero rescue. And we did a hero rescue SSS tier list so what we're going to be doing is talking about that and the potential changes we should do and how each team benefits the team all around before we get the video started make sure to check the description down below there is a link to my twitter and for the twitter we're going to be doing giveaways if you guys hear Falco ignore him we're going to be doing giveaways on twitter we're going to be talking about content we're going to be doing a lot of things on Twitter so make sure to hit that follow button so out of everyone in Hero Rescue as a defensive unit you we have Super Saiyan 3 Goku Fat Boo and Super Saiyan 4 Goku now out of all those units it's a main tank I would have Fat Boo between Vados and Whis I would have actually for this team right here I would probably put Whis just to get a uh, crit bonus but also having Vados is fine so you could have either Vados or Whis for the third spot this can vary. You can either choose Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks, or you can actually go ahead and choose Super Saiyan 4 Goku. This varies. Even though Goku did get a nerf, the percentage of applying lethal is actually still 16%. Whoever translated it messed up, and it was a typo. So I'm going to be doing a video on him shortly. So you could do this team, and then you can definitely you need to run these two people. Either Red Vegeta and Red Goku, or run blue vegeta and blue goku these two teams will go tremendous now the blues are known to be more of a pvp uh team but the reds are known to be more as a pve slash pvp team uh they have the best of both worlds now when it comes to a team like this depending on how you go about it now guys you need to make sure this thing right here is very important Running five SSS units on one team as a free-to-play person is hectic. So make sure to be smart about it. I got many requests for this video. People told me, hey, do this video, do this video, do that video. So I'm doing it for you guys as just like a pleasure thing. You know, like as a free-to-play unit, running five SSS units, resources are tremendous. So be smart on how you put in your units. Now... With a team like this, um, depending on who has evil on the team, so evil for Super Saiyan 4 Goku will target Fat Boo, Evil Boo, Kid Boo, Zamasu, and that's about it. Those are the only units that will have either Unyielding or Reborn. Other than that, I would probably take him out and just put in Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks, because with this... You can steal the energy, apply focus fire, stun the back row, and I think that's the best. You have him causing taunt, so people can target him. Vados with the damage reduction aura plus shield. You have Super Saiyan 3 Goku doing focus fire. You have Vegeta doing a 5 times attack, which high crit means that he goes and uh, Super Saiyan Goku does his skill. I think Super Saiyan Goku also silences units. Plus, he is unaffected by any debuffs because of his immunity, and he gets a skill every turn depending on if everyone's or, or Vegeta's crit is 100%. So you definitely want to have Vegeta faster than Goku. He also hits like a truck. So this is the ultimate team that I would recommend, or like I said, you guys can sub out these two and put in the blues, convergence, high crit, hit reduction, and 100% um, crit by Kaioken Goku. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace. Impressive.